What you guys got another video here for you in this one we're taking a look at how to tell which process is being used by one particular file now normally when we have uh, a virus or something like that or malware on the system uh, it's going to be locking files and folders because the process is running in there and it's very very difficult uh, to delete these particular types of files but i'm going to show you how we can use pieces of software to remove these from the system but before we do that let's have a quick word from today's video sponsor cd key sales if you're looking for a cheap windows 10 pro or cheap windows 11 pro oem key click on this one and then you can uh, see we'll bit the buy now page hit the buy now button put in my promo code capital b capital r 09 and apply this to your order to get a juicy discount once you click apply it will be reduced down to 16 dollars 41 submit your order and then activate your version of Windows 10 or Windows 11 Pro. Now in the up and coming weeks, uh, Power Toys is gonna have a new uh, program added to its list, which is quite an extensive list with useful programs, and it's called File Locksmith. And it's gonna be added to the Power Toys list. And this will show you processes for locking a file and folder so we can unlock those files and delete them from the system or we can rename them or we can delete them on the next reboot so it just allows you to find out what this process is so i'm going to download and install this on the system now it's not in the actual program as of yet but i just want to show you some information on it and i'll show you exactly what it's probably based off of which is called lock hunter and uh, we'll take a both look at those programs today and i'll show you how they work and how you can use it to remove malicious malware or just files that you can't delete on the system because they're being uh, used by the operating system or by the malware itself and you can use this for folders files dll files and all sorts of stuff like that so let's take a look so this is power toys now if you've never used power toys before there is tons of uh, programs in here which are very very useful and they're adding more tools to this kit which I think is well worth installing on your system. If you install it now and keep it updated, eventually the uh, file locksmith will be added to it. And they're working on it as we speak, so it's not going to be long before it's added to the list. You can see already an extensive list here, always on top, awake, color picker, fancy zones, and you've also got a load of other useful programs in here like mouse utilities, also power toys run, uh, and also we've got some uh, screen ruler and a bunch of other ones like text extractor from images so it's very useful and uh, it's well worth installing so let's take a look at what they're adding which is called uh, what's using this file and when you right click on a folder it will look something like this once it's been released to the general public and you can see here it's going to allow you to uh, see all of these processes that are running inside that folder and then you can actually locate it and close it off and uh, stop it or delete it. For years, it's been very difficult to track down uh, processes that are running and using all your system resources. And it makes it very difficult to close these processes where File um, Locksmith is going to allow you to do that. And it should look something like this once it's released, where we all get some sort of GUI and you can just drop down and you'll be able to see all the process ID, the user and the files and end that task for it. And it will force close that file, which is gonna be quite useful for people that are having issues with a particular type of file that is hogging all the system resources and it won't close. And you can also use it to delete. Now, I think it's been based off of the Lock Hunter here. Now, Lock Hunter is a, like an unlocker, basically. If you remember that program called Unlocker many moons ago, it's a pretty decent bit of kit if you've got malicious files on the system, like say a piece of malware that won't let you delete it because it's right protected and all this sort of stuff. Well, this program is going to allow you to do, to do it. So for the meantime, you can install uh, Lock Hunter here and it will let you do this on the system. And I'll show you how it works in a second. You can see by the images on the screen here, basically you'll right click and it will say what's uh, locking this file. And, and it's the same on Lock Hunter. You can see uh, the wording is exactly the same. So they're probably basing it on this particular program. So how is it going to work? So let me just show you here. We're going to go into here. I don't have any malicious files on here, but I want to show you roughly how it works. Let's just say that these files are locked and we can't delete them 
and we can't move them or anything like that. So basically you right click on it, it'll say uh, what's locking this file and it will basically open up a little application like this and you can see here no processes locking this file or folder have been found but if it was it will allow you to unlock it it will also allow you to delete it from the system as well so if this was locked and you want to remove it and it's malicious you can do by deleting it or unlocking it or you can go other and delete on the next system restart. Now this is awesome because I've showed you this before where you're allowed to uh, delete this on the next reboot and basically it used to be called move on reboot and it will delete the file and if it was malicious and you couldn't delete it uh, via this method you restart and it will delete it right at the very beginning of the boot up and it will be gone from the system. Great for removing nasty malicious uh, malware and things like that on the next restart. So let's take a look at this one here. I'll quickly delete this uh, folder here. It's not locked, but I just want to give you an example. So if I wanted to delete this folder and it was locked, all you need to do is click on the delete and it will delete it and it will do all the commands and everything it needs to be done and to force delete that folder for us. If it won't remove it, then you just move it on the next restart and it will remove that folder or file from your computer system. And this is going to be added to uh, Power Toys, which I think is awesome. So you can either use uh, Lock Hunter or File Locksmith once it's added to uh, Power Toys. It's not here at the moment, but you'll get the general idea because they're both going to be based off the same sort of thing. So you get an idea of what's going to be added to Power Toys. So maybe get Power Toys installed and keep it updated, and eventually you'll see it appear inside your tool list, and it's going to be very useful uh, to have as part of your toolkit from removing uh, processes. Anyway, my name has been Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk. Just want to say a quick shout out to all my YouTube members who have joined my YouTube members group. I really do appreciate the support and I shall catch you in the very next video. Have a lovely weekend. Bye for now.